Good morning, everybody. Uh, sorry for the delay. Sometimes it takes a few minutes for Facebook to kick in. Um, and I don't actually don't know I'm actually live. So um, how's everybody doing? Welcome to day 88 of our stay in place order. I see my beautiful wife is listening to me on her way to work. Thank you. I love you. Um, well, we're just going to kind of hang out here for a little bit and see if anybody can. I'm a little bit later than normal for the morning. But people usually do jump in. Uh, so, our COVID count went up. Um, actually went up quite a bit. Seven point seven. Seven yesterday. Good morning, Anita. How you doing? Kitties are doing good. Yes, I got my hair cut finally. Um, oh, four months. I haven't done that since I was a kid. Uh, sorry about that. Somebody visiting my mom next door and um, making some noise. So close my window. Um, Ah, uh, yeah, finally got my hair cut. What a big ordeal that was. Man, uh, those guys, they, you know, they don't use, they can't use the plastic. They, uh, they can use the old traditional drapes, um, but they really don't, it's hard for them to wash them. You know, you have to use a new one every time, and it's expensive. So they have these plastic ones that they put around you now. And so it's like draping you in a garbage bag, but I... If they could have wrapped my ass in fiberglass, I would have still got my hair cut, you know? Um, so, what's going on, guys? What's new this week? Good morning, Susan. How you doing? Sorry I'm a little late this morning. Um, cat issues. Uh, only got two left. Every, uh, the other two have been uh, deposits put on them, so um, only got one little spotted girl and the melanistic boy. If you know anybody um but yeah hey so um minnesota minnesota uh, minneapolis police department has defunded their police department let that sink in they're basically letting the naacp run their um police is work as a police force I don't know. Um, hey, thanks. Yeah. It's, there's no hair left, so I actually have to use hairspray now. Um, so what the hell? And, you know, people need to stop messing with people. There was a there was a post. Hey, Bob, how you doing, buddy? Good morning. How's New York? How are you guys hang, ha handling it out there? Um... I, you know, this is this whole thing with, with, you know, the whole NAACP being a police force. Um, no kidding. The world has gone to hell in a handbasket. Now I read also this morning that India and China are at odds and may go to war. Um, India and China. First of all, I didn't know really India had a, you know, went to war with people, but you know, what do I know? Um, so that could be another turning point in this whole 2020, everybody gets a trophy kind of scenario. You know, 10 years ago when we were, we were saying, oh, Lord, help us if, uh, if, if these, these kids, you know, the generation of everybody gets a trophy and then we're not keeping score and gets in control, they got in control. Good morning, Savannah. How are you? How's my little queenie doing? Yes, somebody got a haircut, and that would be me and Bubba. Bubba got a haircut, too. Um, yeah, so, hey, good to see people on here this morning. You know, I love all you guys, and uh, I love my morning crew. And, uh, yeah. Um, but anyways, people were Photoshopping and doing, taking, like yesterday I saw a thing about with George Floyd. They showed him in handcuffs with his hands behind his back with hair and then they showed him on the ground with no hair clearly photoshopped clearly photoshopped 
But it's like people, a lot of people don't stop and think, is this real? Is this fake? They just start reposting it. Next thing you know, it's blowing up and becomes this giant cluster that we really don't need. There was a post going around yesterday, and I, I reposted it because I didn't know if it was fake or not, but it, even if it wasn't, it was still a good point. Why did why are protesters tearing down a shrine to honor Holocaust victims? What do Holocaust victims have to do with anything with what's going on right now? Yes, race, racism to Jewish people, I get that, but that's not a, a, a symbol of of racism that is a a symbol of appreciation and now we're taking down statues of columbus all over the country pulling down statues of columbus all over the country including the state capital the the statue that's in the state capital of columbus and and princess uh, uh queen isabella is being pulled down today um columbus fan you know columbus people i i i'm not going to go either way with this my feelings of Columbus are, you know, he wasn't the first one here, so don't blame him for, for smallpox. And he didn't even really set foot on the on you on the northern uh, North American soil. So just because you read that in a history book doesn't mean it's freaking true. What we taught, what we were taught in school, was sugar coated history. We were just taught the stuff they wanted us to know to get us through school, and most of that was BS, total BS, total BS. It was just sugar-coated history. And from the 1950s forward, that's the crap we were spoon-fed. History's ugly. History's ugly both directions. And if you don't, if you, and it's not for you to like, dislike, to, to, to disgrace, to dishonor, to honor, whatever, it's history is history. What happens in the past is history. Good or bad? I mean, if you want to go look at it, and you know the stuff that we, the stuff that we were taught in school is horrendous. I don't know how. I, I don't know how. It's, it should be criminal. It should be criminal, because they, the, what they taught us in school was just was not right. And they, there was a lot of good history that they really could have taught us, um, but no, they didn't. So. Um, Well, I think they are, uh, Savannah. I think the the history, your history, your social studies teacher is definitely social studies. Mm, um, is definitely they're 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 thinking about this more. Um, they they understand, and I mean, but the, it's all comes down to the board, the school board, what the school board is going to allow you to teach. Um, let's see what else we got here. Um, uh, yeah, exactly, Anita. It, it, it's. It's crazy. It, it, it's stupid, actually. That with it, and, and people are doing it on purpose. They're just trying to rile people up. See how far their post can be spread. I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. Um, Paula, if you're still watching, good morning. Um, let's see. Anybody else? Yes, yes. I got a haircut today. Day eighty-eight. Uh, my my. Description is let's all be excellent to each other um, from Bill and Ted. And Bill and Ted have a new movie coming out. Um, probably, uh, who knows when. Um, there's a lot of movies in Hollywood that have just been pretty much put on hold. And you're not, you know, you're not only are you not going to be able to really get a, night, a 2020 car, but you're not going to see a 2020 movie. <laughs> um, It was like when we had the crash in 2008, 2007, 2006. Hollywood kind of shut down too. You didn't see any major blockbusters. You didn't see any major movies until like 2011, 2012. Because they were all in, in a panic too. Everybody lost their shirts. Um, so... Yeah, Bob, I'm I'm mean, I'm scared for this country too. I don't know what's going to happen here if they're t if they're defunding police departments and they're letting these this ANSTA, I think I got that right, run this uh, the, the the new nation of Chaz, C A N Z, I think Chans. I don't know what you want to call it, 
Um, now they're now they're now they're 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 M16s. I don't know if it's true or not. They they show that they, their 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 police force are walking around with M16s. Uh, I don't know if it's true or not. I'm kind of just trying to stay away from that because it gives me anxiety. Um. Anyway, so all right, guys. Thank you for letting me rave for a little bit and show up my new do. And um, I get to I got to talk to my little girl. Maybe I'll talk to her a little bit later. Um, here you go. Elbow bump. Live long and prosper. Stay home. Stay healthy. Stay safe. Um, wear your mask because you love your fellow human beings. Um, we love you. I love you guys. See you tomorrow morning, day 89. And um, I'm out of here. Later.